Quick Spot is a projector that projects the drill pattern in the form of light dots, which, when correlated to the points of line and grade, enables the responsible miner to accurately mark off the pattern of blast holes to be drilled on the tunnel face. This is the projector that we're now going to use to mark off the rock face. This is a portable projector. This projector can do a 6 meter wide by 6 meter high tunnel. It uses a 12 volt 18 amp hour battery and it connects to the battery with crocodile clips and it fits under your tripod. I'm just going to put the projector onto the tripod and just screws in to the tripod. I'm going to just explain to you how we set this projector up. Normally when the face, when the rock face is clean, we just go to the rock face and just take approximately 10 paces like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we set the projector up on its tripod more or less in the center of the tunnel. It doesn't have to be exactly in the center of the tunnel. It can be a half a meter to the left or to the right of your center line. I'll now proceed to show you how we do the setting up of this projector. The projector is normally set, if you're doing a four by four tunnel, you set it up normally 1.5 meters off the ground. If your tunnel is a bit bigger, say a 5 by 5 meter, you will then set your, your projector about 2 meters off the ground. We always try and get the projector more or less in the center of the tunnel because if it is too low, you will get distortion of your top holes. Um, we have now connected the projector to the battery and we have the draw pattern that we are now going to use for this particular tunnel. It has been worked out precisely and it is 100% according to what the mine have given us to, uh, to produce this pattern. We take this draw pattern which is on a metal disc and we insert it into the projector and the projector has now been lined up we have now set the projector up more or less 10 meters from the rock face, more or less in the center of the tunnel, and we are now going to switch the projector on. And uh, as you can see, the, the projected pattern on the rock face, the first thing we do is that we focus the pattern. You can see this has a focusing mechanism. We focus the dots on the face, and then we line the gray lines, which are those three dots on the left and three dots on the right. We line that up on gray, and the three dots on the top is your direction line. So we line that up first, and as you see, we then zoom the pattern in and out. We zoom it in and out until we See those two double dots there and those two double dots there. When a one meter stick fits between those two dots, those two double dots there, then all your holes are in focus and are the right distance apart. And once that has been established, you can now proceed to mark off all the light dots. When marking your rock face tomorrow, you'll see that your cut it's that conglomeration of holes there. We've put it to the right hand side. So tomorrow when you mark off this round, all you have to do is rotate the pattern 180 degrees, which I'm going to do now. As you can see, we line up with grade and direction again. You can see there's the grade and direction. And you now notice that that the cut holes, that conglomeration is now on the left hand side 
and you zoom the projector in and out until your one meter stick fits perfectly between those two dots and those two dots there. When that one meter stick fits between those two dots, all your holes are in focus and are the right distance apart. And you can now mark off your face, mark all the light dots, and once you've marked all the light dots off, your face has now been marked and you can bring the jewelry in to draw. And that's how we mark the rock face off with this projector. When we mark off tunnels 4x4 four four and larger, we recommend that the tripod that we use is an elevating tripod. As you can see, it has an elevated head. And the reason why we use this tripod is that we try and get the projector more or less in the center of the tunnel. Because if it is too low, you will get distortion of your top holes. So that is why we recommend that you use an elevating tripod in tunnels that are 4x4 four four and larger. You can see it's got a rotating handle here. Yeah. We also have the draw pattern which is on a metal disc and the mine gives us the draw pattern which they require for a certain tunnel. We then produce this draw pattern or graticule which is precision draw and this is the pattern that fits into the projector like that. So this is a metal radicule and each pattern is made specifically for each type of tunnel being drilled. If you've got a 4x4 or 5x5 or 6x6, we have to make a pattern for each type of tunnel. So for every type of tunnel you have different types of tunnels, you've got to have a metal radical made for that specific tunnel. And that is where the metal gravity fits into the projector. Thank you. These illustrations clearly indicate tunneling before and after using quick angle and quick spot. The quick angle and quick spot for tunneling. Two reliable instruments proudly produced and distributed by Quickmark. Your partner in tunneling accuracy.